Welcome, in front of me I have Zeb Z watch and I'm gonna show you how to pair this watch with your Android phone. First we need to turn on our watch. To do it, simply press and hold the middle button. Once you see the logo on the screen, you can release the button and after the watch turns on, you should see the list of languages on the screen. You can scroll through this list by swiping up and down on the screen, like this. Now, uh, find the language you like to use on your watch and tap on it to select it. I'm gonna select English in my case. And after you select the language, you should see the QR code on the screen. Now we need to download and install the Zep application on our uh, phone. You can do it in two ways. You can either scan the code from the watch with the phone's camera or just open the Play Store and search for the app right there. I'm just, gonna, I'm just gonna open the Play Store, tap on the search, and type in Zep, and then tap search button. Now let's select the Zep application from the list. And on this page, let's tap on the install button to install the app. And after the app is done installing, we can tap on open button to open it. Once the app opens, we need to log in into an account. You can also create a new account if you need to by tapping on create an account now. Or, or rather, you can also use the third party accounts to log in, like Xiaomi, Facebook, Google, um, and those two, I'm not sure uh, what they are. I'm just gonna log in uh, via email, so I'm gonna tap right here, type in the email address, then tap right here and type in the password. So give me a couple of seconds. And once you're done entering the password, you can tap on sign in. After you log in, you should see this on the screen, tap on got it. Now we can allow or deny some permissions like uh, access to photos and media. I'm just gonna allow it, but you can deny it if you want. And after that, you should see the homepage of the app. Now let's tap on the profile icon then select the uh, Add Device, or rather tap on the Add Device button, right here. Select the Watch category, tap on Got It. And now uh, we need to allow the permission for the location. You can also deny it, but I believe if you deny it, you won't be able to pair the devices. So I'm just gonna allow the permission. It's gonna ask us to allow it for all the time, but I'm just gonna select again allow only while using the app and go back, then tap on got it. And if you want to scan the QR code, uh, we need to allow the permission for the pictures and videos. So let's again tap on while using the app. And now let's select the, categ the category with uh, watch with QR code. And let's scan the code with our phone. So pick up the phone, point the camera at the watch to scan the QR code and it should start start pairing the devices. Now let's confirm the pairing by tapping on the check mark. Here we have a little tutorial how to use the watch. We can go through it by swiping left and right. And we need to wait a couple of seconds. And once you see the get started button, tap on it to finish the setup. And after the setup, you should see the device page for your Zep Z watch, as you can see. And of course, your watch is ready to use. You can use it now. And that's how you pair this watch with your Android phone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving a like on the video.